Okay, this is video number five in the arms at the top of the backswing series. If you haven't watched the previous ones, please watch them. Okay, remember what we've done so far. We've learned how to hitch a rod. We've learned how to fold our arms. We've learned how to fold our arms and turn. And now we're going to learn how to take our golf stance and fold our arms. Everything's building up to this. We've done everything standing up so it becomes simpler mentally to visualize what we're doing and learn what we're doing. We're taking all the angles out of the golf swing. Now we're adding them back in. Hopefully you've drilled this movement so much that it will become automatic when you do it. So just take your golf club, take your golf stance, and go do your backswing and hitch a rod. Stand up and turn straight. Now look at your arms and make sure they're in the right position. Remember what is the right position? Your lead arm should be straight, not ramrod straight, but straight and at shoulder level. In fact, your palm should be flat. Your club should be level with the ground. Your trail arm should be off your chest, but in front of your chest. That's the right position for your arms at the top of the back swing. Again, just keep doing this. Come up to your top of your backswing position and stand up straight and look at your arms. Now this will be interesting for you. Remember in the first lesson, I told you to do that drill. Come to the top of your backswing position, stand up straight and take a good look at your arms. Compare how they look then to how they look now. And compare, to, compare how easy it was to get into this top of the backswing position now as it was before. Before you had to think you were struggling, it just didn't seem right. Now they just go. And it's literally one thing you can just check off your golf list that you don't have to think about on the course. Again, just take your stance. We're just get, gonna go to the top. And then we're gonna stand up straight and look at our position. Do that in increments of five. Just take your position. Remember, just turn like you're taking your standard practice swing. If you're not getting your arm level, uh, you may feel like you need to pull or lift your arm a little bit. That's fine or lift your uh, lead arm. But when you stand back up, you want that lead arm square with the ground. And that's how you take your uh, arm position at the top of the back swing. It's not complicated. Don't make it complicated. Uh, it becomes complicated when you throw the angles in. Really, you take the angles out and it's pretty simple.